And of course, y'all know with synthetic wigs, they're here for a good time and a long time. So don't expect this. Hey, my doll, so it's your girl, and you come at you guys today with a review being brought to you by ElevateStyles.com. As you've seen in a previous clip, we are reviewing Sensational's Dashley Lace 22. She's going to be in a T430 color, and here's what she is looking like. Very, very pretty. Very simplistic style, nothing too over the top. She's going to get you there, get you going, okay? So, um, cap construction, you get a total of three combs, two combs in the front. A comb in the back, and then you're gonna get adjustable tab, um, adjustable straps. Lord, I haven't done this in a while. <laughs> a little rusty. But anyway, um, she does come with the baby hairs along the perimeter of the unit. She is a lace parting unit, so you don't have much um lace parting to work with, as you guys can see. This is what your parting area is looking like. Um, your lace is going to give you your your coverage. Um, let me show you what her parting area is looking like. Baby girl is going to need to be plucked, as you guys can see. Um, the knots are very visible on this one, but of course, you know, you can um, definitely conceal them with either some lace tint or some of your own foundation. I'm probably going to do the lace tint, see how that works. If that doesn't, you know, camouflage knots too much, I'm going to go ahead and use my... Um, foundation <laughs> okay um but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and get her thrown on for you so just give me one moment all right y'all so i have 22 on um she is probably about a good 28 inches on me y'all know i'm four foot ten so i'm not that tall but here's what she's looking like on me before i do any kind of manipulation to her there is just my stocking cap. Here is what the tabs are looking like. Let me show you all the. This is all the hair to the front, by the way. Very good density. It's not too heavy, not too thin. Very, very natural. Um, okay, so very natural density. Um, she does have these slight curls in the front to kind of help frame your face so it's not too dead looking in my opinion, which I'm not mad at. So just give me one moment. I'm gonna go ahead and just her up, tint the lace and do all that good stuff. Hold on one moment. Hey my doll, so we are going to get started um with styling. I went ahead and I applied the even lace tint spray. And as you guys can see, it's no longer ashy. And I'm going to go ahead and go in with um, some plucking. Now, you don't have to pluck, but for me and my wig, we don't pluck. Because that parting, I was not a fan of. So, I'm concentrating mad hard right here <laughs> with this plucking. But my plucking paid off. Because let me show y'all the parting area after I plucked it. Okay. Do y'all see that? A nice, clean part looks good so let's go ahead and lay the unit down i'm gonna go ahead and take my um kiss edge effect glued wax stick and this wax stick is so bomb i love it for my wigs and my natural hair as well but this wax stick is really really good and so once i um applied the wax to the wig i'm gonna go ahead and take that flat iron to it just to get the little hump out because that hump was not the business okay so we're taking that hump out and then we're gonna go about our business but for overall this unit pretty easy all right my doll so i am done with dashley lace front 22 Oh, she is very, very cute. I cannot complain about her. She is going to be one of those synthetic wigs where you don't have to do anything extra to her to make her look good. Like, you can definitely take her straight out the pack, apply your lace tint spray, some waxes, just to, you know, get the, because she does come with a little hump, get that little hump out the way, um, and boom, she's very much stout for you. She has a very good density on her. This is from the Dashley collection. So Dashley collection, you in and out with this um, particular collection because with this one, like I said, very simplistic, nothing too much to fuss about. I like it, very classic style, bust down middle part, she gets to go. This one does come with baby hairs, but of course, you know, I'm from that era of wearing wigs where we didn't need baby hairs to make a unit look good. 
And she looks good, honey. Okay, she looks good. So um, here is what that parting area is looking like. Once I went in and plucked the parting area, I just mainly plucked towards like right here and then I stopped and I added some lace tint spray and then I went in with my wax stick and hot comb just to get her all nice and sleek. And boom, this is what we got. This is, like I said, no must, no fuss, very simplistic. She is under $30. So of course I will leave her link in the description box so y'all can go ahead and call her because y'all don't want her. I definitely am trying, I need to get her like a number two. Um, The number two is calling my name, but this T430, I really like the color. It's not too bad. It's not too shiny, but um, you know, this is a synthetic wig. So she is going to tangle up on you. And of course, y'all know with synthetic wigs, they're here for a good time and a long time, so don't expect this one to last you too long. You probably could get like maybe three or four wigs out of her before she starts looking crazy. But for the most part, um, she's gorgeous. I have no, no problems out of her. Like I said, just slight tangling here and there. But of course, you know, a paddle brush, your fingers, and you're good to go. So let me know what you think about Lace 22 on me. Of course, let's comment down in the um, comment section so we can keep it up as always. And I will talk to you guys later.